A local favorite family restaurant for generations is now fighting to keep from being torn down to make way for light rail. It's the Village Inn restaurant right next to Bridgeport Village, which could be the last stop of the proposed Southwest Corridor light rail line. Our Lisa Balick looking into this. She joins us live from there. Lisa? Well, the one thing people need to keep in mind is that it's not a done deal yet. Again, this is a proposed line. They won't even come up with the idea of exactly where it ends out here until later this year. But the owner of this restaurant says now is the exact time when he needs to get involved before it's a done deal. I started here unofficially when I was 10 years old. This is the first time I bust a table and worked for tips and tips alone. But now, instead of tips, Ryan Sweeney is collecting petitions to save his restaurant. The co-owner of the family-owned Village Inn in Tualatin says he was told last spring this is the site plan for a park and ride or a bus turnaround at the end of the proposed new Southwest light rail line. I've got a letter from the government that says we're taking your property and until that changes or the project is officially squashed, I, I've got to I've got to fight against it. Sweeney did move the restaurant back in 2005. When Bridgeport Village developers came in, they wanted his land for part of their project, but they built him a new restaurant close by. This time, he may not have a choice, though, whether to stay or go. Is he going to have to move? We don't know the answer to that question yet. Metro, which is planning the light rail line, says there is no decision yet on exactly where the line will end near Bridgeport. We've been hearing from a lot of customers from the Village Inn. We've been talking to the Village Inn a lot. We know that it's a really important resource for the community, so our intent is to work over the next couple of years with them. Some restaurant customers tell me they'll be at public hearings to save the family business that's been here for more than 40 years. So it's wrong. Mm -hmm. It's wrong that they, they want to do that. As of now, there is still no federal or local funding approved for the Southwest Corridor. But plans to make it happen are moving ahead. Your traffic. Now, that public hearing I mentioned is going to be this Thursday night at 6 p.m. at Tigard City Hall. So they're asking anybody who supports the restaurants to come out, support them as they make their plea as far as where that route's going to be. Again, a decision, final decision, not till later this year. Live in Tualatin, Lisa Balick, Coin 6 News. And again,